the nearest. You're now leaving Bright Falls. Come back soon, sign. We're going to the Anderson farm. I knew you were gonna say something like that. You know what? You owe me big time for this. When this is through, if we make it, I don't care what anybody says, I'm done with darkness. You're gonna buy me a tanning bed as a gift, and I'm gonna live in it. That house is something evil and ferocious, and I don't like it. Also, why do you have to take the cutout of Alan with him? <laughs> Is that in the back seat, little cutout of Alan sitting in the passenger seat, like, hey, hi, very nice to be here. <laughs> I'm crazy, but that's fine, Barry. <laughs> oh, you got that right, Al. You're barking mad. You are by far the craziest. But maybe that's inevitable when you deal with crazy stuff like this. It helps. This is happening, Barry. Alice, they never had Alice. She's trapped in the darkness at the bottom of the lake, but she's not dead. Al, how can you know that? I know, Barry, I can- Al, I- No, listen, I can bring her back. I can find her. There's something special about this place. The lake, it, it does something to the works of art created here. It makes them come true. But there's a catch. The dark presence, whatever that thing is, twists it to its own ends. That's why all of this is happening. It's using my manuscript to take over everything. Al, I believe you. It happened to Thomas Zane before. It happened to the Andersons. I believe you. Crazy or not, you're not delusional. Weird shit's going down. That's a fact. I'm on board, man. I'm with you. The Andersons knew about it, but they were too far gone to tell me with all the drugs they were on. But they wrote it down. There's a message somewhere at their farm, Barry. We just need to find it. Look out! Rock slide! That is a hit if I ever saw one. Ow! I'm surprised he's still God alive after that. Now, talk to me. Hit his side of the track. <laughs> yep, that's his leg. That's definitely his leg. I had lost my gun in the crash. Barry was nowhere to be seen. Yeah, but you can Barry. hear him. Barry! Oh, man, you're okay! Jeez, it's good to hear your voice! I was trying to get out of the car, but the ground gave way! Man, what a drop! And don't worry, your cutout is fine! I don't see Forget why you that. have that thing! Are you okay? I hit some bushes, didn't get a scratch! There's no way you can climb down, though! It's like a sheer wall! Ah, Al, there's something moving down here! Barry, it's a taken! Use a flare, Barry! There we go! Oh, yeah! Barry, are you all right? <laughs> I'm good, Al. I'm great. Guess he never messed with anyone from New York City before, huh? Well, there's the Anderson farm. You're gonna have to find your way around to the farm, Al. I'll be waiting. Looks like I have to get over to that main building over there. Barry, Hello. just wait for me, okay? Al, I'm not staying here. It's suicide. I'm going to the farm. I'm gonna go ahead and secure the area. You can catch up. Don't worry about it. I'm on the case. Now he's Rambo. <laughs> this would turn into a disaster if I didn't catch up with Barry. Ooh, lightning. I'm so I have to go to that main house over there, but in the meantime, I have to go through the granary, the barn, the wheat field. There's Barry, I think. Yeah, that's Barry. He's carrying the cutout. Ugh. You know, that's the one thing I like about this game. It at least has some sense of humor to it, instead of... It being all serious. Yeah, you can do whatever you want with me. You don't have a gun or a flashlight. Or even flares for that matter. Or flashbangs or whatever. Yeah, 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 whatever. You can throw your objects at me. I can't fight back anyway. Oh, oh, there's floodlights here. I can't fight back. Hello. Oh, good. Hmm. doesn't want me getting this page apparently. You hear dramatic music in the background. Now all these shelves are gonna come to life, aren't they? Or not. And the light died. Oh, guess what? Wheelbarrow. Whoa! You're right in the path of this. You're dead. It's like an obligatory no light segment, kind of. 
Whoa! I don't even know if they hit me or not. I mean, not people that gonna come and get me or anything. Everything here is trying to kill me! Ow! Thank you for invincibility frames, otherwise I'll be dead. I don't think there's anything I can use here to combat this for now. I just need to dodge and run and keep going. Although Al is, Ellen is like, I'm gonna die. My heart's gonna explode. Okay, fine. Catch up. Hello. I needed a light to destroy them to get through. Oh, I had to go up here again. I thought I was gonna have to go into that little dark tunnel area where we're probably gonna die horribly. Whoop. Another page. Might read all of this in a later video, but not now. Where is the gent? Yep, there it is. One, and two, and three. And I thought for a second that was like a freaking jump scare or something. Okay. I have a light. Now. Huh? How do. Oh. Beep! Oh, oh excuse me. Oh, no, 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 no. Physics! And of course that has to die after I've you I could sense the movement it. in the woods ahead. Facing the enemy without a weapon was dangerous, but I had no choice. Yeah. Sorry, Al. You've got a flashlight with zero batteries. <gasps> hey look guys, there's an obligatory no no weapon segment. Hello! I see That's a fisherman talking to me. <laughs> Who knew? Oh, hello. Uh, uh, uh. Ow! Ow! I just want to pick up these batteries, man. Ow! Uh. Ah! Ah! Uh, dead. How many times are gonna die? In How many times am I gonna die in this? Several, maybe. I could I don't sense know. the movement in the woods ahead. Facing the enemy without a weapon was dangerous, but I had no choice. Yeah, well, I believe you, Alan. Let's just get this flashlight and be on our way. Quick! Need to reach the generator before the take can get to you. Run! Run! Okay, that's a good start. Ow! Okay, fine! Don't let me start the generator. Jeez! No! Stay away! I have to get over there. That's the next spotlight. That's the next my next save point. Whoa, jeez. Ow. Make it up the staircase, Alan. Go. Oh. Thank goodness. I don't have a gun, so this makes things even worse. Okay, the farm's down there. Everything is so convoluted. What the hell? A car was driving away from the farm, headed in the same general direction as I was. For all I knew, it was Barry, caught in the consequences of leaping before looking. Yeah, well, Barry's like that. He's got a cardboard cutout of you. He'll be fine. What's this? Is this a heavy duty flashlight? <gasps> yes, it is. No, let me use it. Thank you. And coffee. Why can't I use? Wait, what? Oh, that's a lantern. Never mind. Okay, so I have more flashlight power, but you get a thingy. The car was heading for the cabin up ahead. It wasn't far. If it was Barry, I would see the damage soon. I. It probably won't be Barry, given how this game is going. He'll be at the farm, and this will be someone else, like the sheriff or someone. I don't know. Whoop. Hello. Yep, there's that suspense. I'm just gonna stand here until you die. I'm gonna take a drink of water while I'm waiting. Water. Right. Now that we have a heavy duty flashlight. What? The heck? I'm trying to deliver each page to the right time and place. I'm trying to show you how the story goes. Is that you, Zane? And he's... I had seen glimpses of the light before. 
I had seen it in my dream. It was a strange spaceman or a diver in a bulky suit. He was the one who'd been placing the pages on my path. Oh, look, a bear trap segment. Wonderful. Well, I have flares, which is a nice thing. And these traps appear to be made of solid bronze, which they, which means they reflect light nicely enough. <laughs> it's like the state has enough money to cut to cover all their bear traps in solid... In... I hate you. I really do. I hate you. Oh. At least this still works. And I have this. Someone had left a gun behind. Now I had a fighting chance of reaching. The taken the are filled with darkness. Anything else you want to say to me before you And bullets, which is or the rich shells, which is a nice thing. Can I get up there to that cop you know I gotta skip this thermos. I know you're there, I'll come back for you in a later video. I don't know. I'm just gonna go this way because I have a shotgun and I have a shotgun now. Oh look, more bear traps. Solid bronze bear traps. I get a sinking feeling that people are following me. Hello! You know, I'm just gonna run. And hope and pray that I don't step on any traps. Ooh. Ow! Okay, I let myself get it by that one. Whoa, Nelly! Wow, big guy! No. And to all of ye, I say nay. I could see the car, but there was no sight of the driver. This is a familiar cabin. Hello? Anybody here? Barry! No! Danny, you're not! Please! What are you? Please! No! Don't! I'm sorry! Well, whoever it is up there, they, they probably need our help. This is a pump action shotgun, but it needs space for two shells. What the hell? Hello? I know you. You were in jail the other day. I went to the farm again for the moonshine, you know? It makes you see. They're, they're not going to miss it. They're in the loony bin. My buddy, Danny, I lost him. Something's gone wrong with him. It's not him. Like a real bad follow-up to a real good movie <laughs> the best friends suddenly the bad guy who, who wrote this crap anyway <laughs> and he's dead yep he's dead ah oh, my eyes I've run through every possible course in my head if I continue like the Dark Presence wants me to, the story I'm writing won't save Alice. It's a horror story, and it's going to kill her, and me, and everybody in this town. No one will survive. Darkness will consume everything. This is what it's wanted all along. It will be free, unstoppable. It used Alice to get to me, dangled her in front of me to keep me going. It was never going to release her. I'm going to change this. I'll escape. I'll write the ending to your own story. I've written Whoops. myself into the story. I'm now the protagonist. This feels like a terrible risk, but it's the only way to save Alice. I'll be bound by the events of the story just as much as anyone else who's been woven into it. The story must stay true for this to work. There have to be victims along the way. Near escapes. Cliffhangers. In a horror story, it can't be certain that the hero will succeed or even survive. He almost has to die. I'll write my own escape into the story next. I need help. Zane's going to be the one who will help me. I'll make it happen. And the TV died. Alright, let's keep going to our objective, which is down this way. Oh, 
Hello. I have light. You're gonna die. See, you're dead. Guess. Danny, huh? The farm was still a good distance away. I'd need a car to get there fast. What in the world? Oh, well, I guess that's what people in America do. Boop. Flares and f a flare and a flashbang. Well, wait, hold on. I don't say better than nothing, but I think there's something up here. Oh no, it's just the way back into the house. Never mind. 